All right, um, I'm going to do a little walk through here on how to set up and configure a Rackspace cloud server with uh, Ubuntu and um, probably do WordPress and virtual min and a few other things. So first of all, let me get back into my Rackspace account here. And I just set up a server to do this on called server one. So it will pull up the terminal here. Okay, I don't know why it went all the way over here. There we go. Okay. Just here in the microphone. So we'll do SSH root at. Oh, I'm still setting up a little snitch. And now um, I just remembered I didn't get the, I didn't save the password. So. Hope I did that right. Second here. All right. Okay. First things first. I'm trying to think how we want to do this. We'll do. Um. I've installed the lamp stack every way from you know. Um. Oh, Taskel, and I think that's what it's called, or something like that. Task, task cell, task select, um, to individually app get. Uh, recently, I started. I've been doing app get install. Oh, what is it? Lamp server, and then PHP my admin. It. It'll take a few minutes. Yes. Okay. Password for your MySQL user. I'll do Apache. Hit spacebar to select and then enter. All right. Set up uh, my PH, PHP my admin, is it? I think now. Yeah. So uh, yes, password, PHP admin password, mismatch. Okay, so now we got to be able to. Go to our website and it works. I think that installs everything. Let me see. Mm. Okay, oh, I guess so. I never can remember what the I guess. Um I just added pair and I don't know G D I can't I don't know if it was already installed or not. I might just want to run it in case. Yeah, okay, it was already the newest version. That's for um picture resizing you need it, I think. I don't know. <laughs> mm. So now we can go to cd forward slash var forward slash www. Index is in there. Um, I'll just do wget http wordpress.org latest. 
So. Okay. App get install unzip. So unzip latest.zip. That put it in the WordPress folder. Mm, I don't want it there. I'm going to put it in my root. So I'll do move all. Will this work? Oh, yeah. So now. Oh, remove index.html. There's our work. Well, first of all, we need to a couple things. We'll set up our database first. So that'll be your your IP address or host name slash PHP my admin. Your pat your username and password. We'll do create a new database called Word. Press. Good deal. Uh, just because it's a good idea, and I'm using the password the same root, we'll do a new account so we don't use root to log in with our WordPress database. Where am I going? Right. Add new user. The WordPress user. Localhost. Grant all privileges. Check all. Go. Okay. So now we're going to skip a step, but I'll just demonstrate here and we'll pretend like we make an error. Username. Password. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Um, database host is localhost, and we'll leave the prefix the same. All right, it says that it can't write the WordPress config file. That's because the permissions, because we did all this as root. So we'll go up a level. We'll say chone or whatever you say, crown, I guess it is, or something. Um, recursive. Then we'll use Apache's username, which is www stash data, and you can add the group. You don't have to. And um, then we'll do www. So now, if we go back, try it again. All right, we can run the install. Site title. We will do nzb info. Admin, password, your email. And now we can log in. Oh, one more thing that might not be, that I'm gonna guess is not working. I know it's not working. It's gonna be permalinks. So if we go in here, Say permalinks and change them to something like this, and go back, and click not found, and this actually took me days to figure out what was wrong, and um, I will show you. There's a couple of things you need to make sure that um, you have set up. First of all, we need to go to Apache's folder. And then the, um, what is it, CD column? No. CD sites available. Yeah. And then nano default. And now here, you want to make sure, like where it says allow override, allow from, and allow from. Some of these might be set to none. Change them all so they say all. And then hit Control X to get out. 
and then do just to make sure do a2 en mod rewrite mine's already enabled and then run I'm trying to think is that everything we've done mm, uh, yeah a second we'll go ahead and do service Apache to restart no restart and now um we're gonna do I would say the easiest way would be to go to your www folder and then chmod the permissions to 666 or just check just do 777 of um, .ht access and then come over here and change the permanent structure um, that's what they say is best for search engine optimization chain save changes and then go see if it's working the page and it is so now I would go back and change that to 644 just for security and um, that should be everything for, for this let's make sure a plugin can install good to go um, I think we're going to go from here if we're going to go anywhere and I might be back.